full of love myself. Love yeah. myself. Oh, I'm so proud to be just who I am. Welcome back. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Grayson Way channel. And there's something on my mind that I wanted to talk about. As you guys are always gonna know, I always have stuff on my mind. And today, over the holidays, thing I was just thinking about stuff and events that happened in my life over the weekend. And I just got to thinking, you know, we as a people love to complain how big our problems are. We, we love to complain how big our problems are all the time. And we will talk to anyone that will listen about our problems. That's just the way the world works right now. And I was thinking to myself, I, I, I'm not perfect. I'm not a perfect man by any means. I'm not a perfect man at all. And I do drink and, you know, and I do cuss. As you guys watch our channels, you guys, as you guys watch my channel with me and my wife, our channel, you see that, you know, we're a wild and crazy couple. We get at each other sometimes and we, yell, you know, we don't really yell, but we get angry, with, we get upset with each other. You know, you guys see it, can't not hide it in the video. We are who we are, right? But I was just thinking to myself, self? No, nah, I'm playing. My wife would think that's funny. But, yo, man, we have to figure out a way to channel that energy that we always say. I'm on a real bumpy road, y'all, so my bad. We must channel that energy into something else. And my theory is I'm right along with the, I'm right along with everybody else. When I complain, I complain to everybody else as well. And you know, I believe in God. You know, I know everybody doesn't, but I believe everybody complains to one point or another. It doesn't matter how big it is, how small it is, but I do believe everybody complains about something. You know what I mean? About something. Regardless if you think it's a big deal or doesn't matter. I think everybody complains about something. Brother, it doesn't matter. So I'm just thinking to myself, man. <laughs> we need to figure out the ch we need to figure out a way to channel our energy instead of doing the same thing you've been doing year in and year out. Why don't you figure out a different way? Cuz obviously if you've been doing the same crap you've been doing for 10, 15 years, I mean, it's not working. And what I mean by that is, and you guys heard me say this many times, but th I, this is the first time I said it in this way. Now that's just, this is just me. This is just me. I'm talking to you guys like you guys sitting right in the car with me. This is just me. Instead of complaining to people and complaining to ourselves how big our problem may be, why don't we make if you if you believe in God, why don't you channel that energy and say, "My God is bigger than these problems." Why don't you try to figure out a different way to do it? All I'm saying, even if you don't believe in God, that's on y'all. You know, that's on whoever doesn't believe. But if you are a complainer and you complain to yourself, talk to yourself, complain to other people. Instead of doing the same thing you've been doing, what I'm saying is, why don't you spin it and, and figure out, and instead of doing it in a negative way, doing it in a positive way. And that's for me, because I complain and complain and complain. How about just go, you know what? There's not one damn problem that's bigger than my God, my Father, my Father in Heaven. And Sometimes people don't want to believe it, but if you just start changing your thought process, things will change in your life. And I notice by little things that I do that I'm getting better with, I notice my life is increasing and getting better. 
Because if I keep with the same mindset, you're going to be in the same place for the rest of your life. If you don't, you got to start somewhere. And if you have the same mentality that you had when you were 20 and now you're a 40 something year old person, then that means you're in the same place you were when you was 20. So what I mean is if you got problems, instead of complaining about those same problems, won't you channel those problems into something in a, in a, in a different, better way and channel it into something that you can achieve so whereas you can stop talking or saying that same problem. You get what I'm saying? If, if, if that makes sense. So for me, instead of complaining to my wife about any subject, why don't I start saying to myself and to others, you know what? I'm not going to worry about my problems because my father in heaven is woke, is bigger than those problems. And eventually, as long as I do my part, those problems will, shall pass. They shall pass. But have you noticed your problems stay your problems? And I'm sorry that the, the video won't be steady. This road is very bumpy. So pardon me. Excuse me. Sorry. But haven't you noticed if you keep thinking and saying the same thing, don't you realize a year from now, two years from now, three years from now, four years, you get my drift. You still thinking and harping and annoyed about the same thing that probably happened 15 years ago. Probably happened 20 years ago. Probably. Maybe six months ago. But you have to channel that negativity into something else. Like for me, I, I'm, I'm in a situation right now that's not that big of a deal. It's not. And I'm going to be honest with you. But I go home, I complain, I, I'm, I'm annoyed. And it's not really that big of a deal. So instead of me having that negative energy, why don't I spend that negative energy into something else? And I know it's hard. I'm human. I'm going to get upset. I'm going to get annoyed. I'm going to be pissed off. But why can't I? I'm talking about myself to you guys now. I need to I me I need to figure out how to channel that anger being upset being annoyed whatever you guys want to call it I have to learn how to channel that into something greater than being in a bad mood or annoyed or hot-headed or hot temper or an attitude I need to channel all that into something just turn that dial into something else turn that dial into something else and just make it and just say you know what I never tried this before so let me try this instead of doing that because that I've been doing for a long time and that still has me talking about the same thing. So why don't I say or do or stop talking so much and just do it? Because, you know, talking is cheap. You have to do what you say. So if you're going to say it, you should do it. And that's how. And if you guys can confuse on what I'm saying, I don't know if I'm clear on my message, but my message, <laughs> my message here today is if there's things in your life that you're complaining about whether it's a new complaint or a new comp uh, <laughs> a new complaint if it's a new complaint or an old complaint maybe you as the individual has to have to teach yourself how to channel that what is still bothering your soul into something else so you can get past that because the more in you that is still making you feel some type of way other than good in you and you have to figure out how to release that for, from your aura you have to figure out a way to release that from your soul you have to figure out and more importantly you have to figure out how to release that from your mind because this right here Mm. Let me tell you something.
it's a terrible thing sometimes and it's a fantastic thing sometimes and what I mean by that the way you think can be your worst enemy and that means fighting yourself sometimes you just gotta stop and just sit back and breathe inhale and exhale and don't worry about the negativity or don't worry about what happened last year or six months ago because people are gonna do stuff to you that you don't like guess what you still move on people want to say things to you that you don't like you still move on I'm not telling you and I'm telling myself as well I'm not saying you need to get ran over by people but I'm also not telling you to fight every single person that tries to disrespect you because there's always a better way to treat someone that's disrespecting you it's always a better way violence is never the answer it's never the key never never and that's coming from me to you guys and to everybody that's listening to this and that's what was on my mind y'all i because i'm just like the rest of y'all you know i things are not going my way i i get annoyed but i was thinking to myself instead of doing the same thing that i'm used to doing why don't I say, you know what? There's not a problem that my father can't fix. Why don't I say that and mean it and constantly say that instead of saying the thing that is annoying me out loud? You know what I mean? Because eventually you're going to get tired of hearing it yourself. And eventually the people you're telling it to is going to get tired of it. I don't care if it is your wife or your husband or whoever, family. Because eventually, they're going to get tired of hearing the same thing you talking about. When you still harping on something that happened, whew, yeah, that mean the wind. <laughs> that mean years ago. You still harping on that? Man, let me stay. Hey, man. Nobody want, nobody want to hear that. I, this car literally just pulled in front of me. And I'm like 10 feet from it, y'all. Just just pull right out in front of me. <sighs> anyway. Oh, yeah, and cousin, uh, January 1st, I got you. Um, if you have my number, I need your number, you need my number, so we both can be supporting each other if you guys don't know what i'm talking about in my last video i said um i will stop drinking any alcohol of any kind for the entire month of 2019 and my cousin also has a habit which i'm not gonna say on my channel if she wants it to be said then that's fine she can do that on her channel but i won't say it on because that's not my story to tell that's her story to tell or you can look down in the comments from the last video and she says what uh, she does. So, and that is, uh, and she is Tierra G, if you guys wanna go see her comment. So cousin, yes, I approve. I'll get your number, you'll have my number, and we will be each other support. And um, let's do it. Uh, I, Cause I was gonna, I was gonna do, I was gonna start on Christmas Day, but then she sent me a comment on my channel on my channel and tell me, "Can we do it? To can we do it together?" So, cousin T, if you are still watching this at the end of the video, I love you. You will conquer this. You will do a good job, and we're gonna hold each other accountable. Got it? Love you. Alright, I'm Ron G, y'all. And that's it for this discussion. I would love to hear some comments of something I may have missed or, you know, disagreements. I I, I, uh, I read them all. You know, I don't, I don't care if you hurt my feelings. Or, I read all the comments. So, bring them. Bring, the, bring, bring them on. You understand? Bring them on. So, that's all I got for today. And you guys will see me, my beautiful wife that's about here right now, 
Or maybe you'll just see me in the next video. I don't know. Who knows? But anyway, we'll be back for more videos. Peace. Deuces! <laughs> nah, seriously, yo. I'm out. Peace.